Snapping threads is a critical step in manufacturing, but is your current method costing you valuable time and money? In this video, we'll compare tapping with a CNC, by hand, and with a flex arm to see which method is truly the most efficient and cost effective. The part we're testing has 16 tapped holes, 8 half 13 and 8 3 8 16. We're running 33 parts, meaning a total of 528 holes. Now let's analyze the time and cost of each method. First, let's look at the CNC process. The total cycle time per part is 19 minutes and 23 seconds. That includes milling, drilling, and tapping. The tapping portion alone takes 3 minutes and 24 seconds per part. With changeover included, tapping all 33 parts would take approximately 143 minutes. As you can see, the time quickly adds up, and with the average CNC operating cost of $100 per hour, the expenses rise even further. Now let's try tapping by hand. We all know this is slow, but just how slow? Gavin's doing his best, but at this rate, we might need to cancel our weekend plans. In fact, we tapped one hole by hand and it took 1 minute and 22 seconds. Now imagine doing that for 528 holes. Now let's tap with the flex arm. The RE16 electric flex arm taps the same part in just 1 minute and 50 seconds. With changeover included, we can tap all 33 parts in only 70 minutes. That's over an hour saved compared to CNC tapping. And the savings don't stop there. Here's how all three methods compare. The CNC takes 143 minutes. Hand tapping? Let's just say that's not even in the conversation. And the flex arm gets the job done in nearly half the time of the CNC. Now, let's talk cost. With labor and machine expenses, tapping on the CNC costs more than using a flex arm. And while a flex arm is an upfront investment, it quickly pays for itself in saved time and labor costs. FlexArm offers multiple models to fit your needs. Based on labor savings, here's how long it takes to pay off each one. The RE16 electric flex arm taps the same number of parts in just one hour and 10 minutes, making it one of the fastest solutions available. It offers a great balance of speed and precision, making it a strong option for medium to large scale production. For this particular demo piece, the RE16 would break even in less than 12 days of operation. The A32 pneumatic flex arm completed the batch of parts in 1 hour and 18 minutes. It has a smaller upfront cost, making it an ideal choice for smaller job shops looking to improve efficiency without a significant investment. With regular use on jobs like this, the A32 could recoup its cost in less than 8 days. The GH30 hydraulic flex arm tapped the batch of parts in 1 hour and 22 minutes. While the GH30 is slightly slower on smaller holes, it offers greater versatility with a wider tap capacity range, making it a strong choice for shops working with varied materials and hole sizes. For this type of production, the GH30 would pay for itself in about 32 days. But the benefits go beyond just tapping speed. By moving your tapping offline with a flex arm, your CNC can immediately start machining the next part while the previous part is being tapped. This shaves 3 minutes and 24 seconds off of each cycle while reducing downtime and increasing overall productivity. For over 41 years, FlexArm customers have saved time and money with our tapping solutions. We hope this video gives you a clear real world representation of return on investment that a FlexArm can bring to your shop. Want to see the difference for yourself? Visit FlexArmInc.com to learn more or schedule a tap test today.